Hello everybody, I am back with a quick update video. This is not a vlog today. I am so excited guys because I um, wanted to share an update with my locks. I was gonna wait until my seventh month to bring you like my seventh month update, but because of the transformation that I'm seeing with my locks, I wanted to bring you this update early. Uh, some of you may know that I went to the beach on last weekend because I was on vacation and I ended up going to the Gulf and there was a hurricane down there. So I ended up having to leave early. But the day that I spent down there, I was able to get me some water out of the Gulf. And it has been said by a lot of locked sisters and brothers that salt water from the ocean is better for your hair than natural just water. You know, and I've been using rose water and stuff like that, but I have never seen the transformation that I have been seeing since these last four days that I've been using the salt water. So what I did was I got me a little bottle of drinking water. And after I drunk that up, I, I went and got me some water out of the Gulf. I called this water Hurricane Nate because it was during the storms. And I just filled this bottle up. And what I do with this, I have another bottle that I mix this water with my oils. So I have um, castor oil, I have um, a little bit of argan oil, some peppermint and tea tree oil, some olive oil, and I put a little bit of uh, lavender essential oils in there to give it a little fragrance. And I just shake it up really good. And I spritz my hair with this every day. I've been spritzing my hair since Sunday. So that's four days that I've used my little concoction. You know, I didn't measure anything. I just kind of did like some drops. Like I did like four or five drops of lavender oil. And, you know, just like that. And I just shook it up. So I've been, this is what I've been using in my hair for the last four days. And guys, I see a difference in my locks. They are looking like locks. Before they still, to me, look like two strand twist. Even a lot of the ends still were looking like twists to me. But since I've been using this, it's like they're transforming. And I'm just going to let you guys get a kind of a close-up look at them and see what you think. I was thinking about coloring my hair, and then I changed my mind and said, well, let me think about it. I want like a burgundy, reddish color. And I may still do that, but I just want you guys to see this and see if you see what I see. Okay, so here we go. So I'm hoping that I am in this video. This is like a side view, I'm making sure I'm lined up here. And I'm gonna turn around. And look at them. You can hardly see the two strand twist at all. I mean, you can't hardly see it at all. They actually are beginning to look like locks. I'm so freaking excited. And look at these. These are just like locked at the bottom completely. They were already, but it's like now I feel a little weight to them. When they're wet, they feel kind of heavy. And this is a style that I just wore at work because I'm not yet ready to just like wear them down when I'm at work. So I'm just trying to make sure you guys got a really good view of them. So I'm just moving all kinds of ways that way you can see them. And I hope it's my light is good. And they actually have shrunken. So it looks like my hair is shorter. So that's another thing that lets me know that they're locking because they will shrink and then they'll drop once they lock. So I am very excited to share this with you guys. So if you go to the beach or you go anywhere near the ocean, get you some salt water, use your favorite oils. I'm all off camera. And like I said, I put my little name label on this. This is my Hurricane Nate. <laughs> and I am excited about this. I am glad I'm feeling the progress of my locks. Just wanted to share that with you all tonight. As I say, there's not a vlog today. I just was very excited. I wanted to come on. So I'm, I'm going to still think about whether or not I want to put color in my locks. Leave your thoughts below if you think that I should. I want like a burgundy, as I said, burgundy-ish, reddish 
type color. I don't want to put any bleach in it. So I know that if I do a semi-permanent rinse, it's not going to take real well. I think you can see it like in the light, in the sunlight and things like that, but it's not like something you see, but it might cover, you know, some of this gray I got in my head. So not quite ready to just rock the gray yet. I might do that. Let's say in another 10 years. <laughs> so leave your thoughts below. Thank you for viewing this video. And I hope you have been enjoying my vlogs. I will get back with you right after my seven month lock update. I may come with you with some color. I'm going to pray on it, think about it, talk to some people and see what I want to do. So thanks again. You all have a fabulous evening.